Okay, so super quick video here. I'm working in Final Cut Pro, and this is a terrible screen, <laughs> terrible headshot there. And I want to be able to put a screenshot or another clip in my video. And I don't like these super sharp corners that are here. I'd like them to be a little more soft and a little more rounded. And I did some Googling to try and figure out how to do this. And the first couple links weren't terribly obvious to me, but there's a very simple solution. It's called a shape mask. And that's what it looks like. And let me show you how to apply that. So first you go down to the bottom right here to this effects browser, and we will search for a mask. There is a draw mask and a shape mask. The draw mask is more for custom shapes that you want to be able to draw yourself. And the shape mask is specifically meant for pretty much what we're trying to do. So you'll drag that onto your clip and you'll see that it pretty gets pretty close to what we were looking for here. There's a few things that I do want to point out. For starters, you can just click on this to move this around. Um, you can drag the sides for the width and the height of this mask. The, you can do the same thing over here. Um, this sort of window here, if it doesn't show up automatically, it is called the inspector, and you can get that by pressing Command-4 as well. So, yeah, the you can also adjust the, the width and the height of your mask from here. But the big thing to point out is probably this feather option that shows how hard does the, the, the edges sort of fall off there. So that's another, another one to play around with. The only other thing that I will comment on is it can sort of, you can like lose your mask almost. So I've been in this position where, you know, I'm editing my video, blah, blah, blah. And then, you know, I want to move this mask around and it's not terribly obvious how to do that. You just want to click on your shape mask in the effects section and, and then you'll be able to, to move this around at will. And sometimes you can even lose sort of that, what do they call this? Yeah, this, this is the show shape mask on screen controls. So make sure that is selected and that will let you do the, the on screen controls of, of the mask. So that was another good thing to, that took me a little bit to figure out. So yeah, once you do that, you can play around with it, customize it how you're looking for. And I will leave these other parameters here as an exercise for the viewer. But that's all I have for you today. Thank you for watching. I hope this helped. If it did, a simple like, comment, or subscribe would be greatly appreciated. Cheers.